Hi, this is MTV214. I'm reviewing the new from McFarland Toys Bookworm. He's from the 60s TV show. So I just got this the other day from McFarland and I want to show them all. So it's the front of the package with the same like 60s classic TV series packaging, city skyline on the bottom, in the back. Digital render the figure with Batman Robin back here and other things legalese. Here's the barcode. Let's open this up and take a look. This is one that I was looking forward to getting the most because of uh, for the villains. There's King Tut and Mr. Freeze and the Joker and the Riddler and Cat two Catwoman actresses that played her as well as like Lord Deathman, the Penguin and I think that's about it that I can think of so I didn't open this up previously so I have to cut off and then clip them in Sorry for the sound is raining out now. Um, one of my cats is messing around with something. So, let's see. So he comes in a suited body. Arms can go up and around. More than 90. Single joint of the rotation. Head can go back and forth. Up and down a bit. I don't think he has much movement in the middle. Yeah. Oh no, yeah, he can go underneath the suit. Legs can go forward and back. Single joint of the rotation. The wrist can go. So, it's decent for like the six inch retro line. And he comes with. This magnifying glass it's under the tape. Let's see if this actually is like see through clear plastic. Yes, it is. Not sure how much I can magnify. Yeah, sort of. Sort of does work. So this would have to go in this hand. This fist is kind of. It opened kind of big, so I have to have it go wrap around there. The glasses don't have the plastic in there, but that's fine. So let's see him. Some other figures from various lines. I'm just standing around here. So here's Bookworm with some figures from various lines. On the right is Jane Cargill, which is from Jazzwares, then there's Trish Stratus, which is Mattel. Behind Bookworm is Wolverine from the new upcoming like Deadpool Wolverine movie. And there's the my kid bash Mandalorian at the back left. So he's six inch figure, can fit in with those. Seven inch would be a little harder. And um is the retro style, so it doesn't have such great articulation, but he's a cool figure to fit in with the the 60s Batman villains comment like subscribe for more content you can check out my older videos as well thanks have a great night take care